How's it going? I'm Anthony Todd. Today we're going to do problem number 10 in my work, energy, and power unit. Okay. Um, a spring force is given by the formula F is equal to 20x minus 12x squared, where F is in newtons and x is in meters. What is the change in potential energy when the spring is stretched 3 meters from equilibrium position? Now that the change in kinetic, or sorry, the change in potential energy is equal to the negative integral of the force function with respect to x, but with changing with respect to x dx. So um, we, if we know our force function and we integrate that, we can then get how much change in energy we have. Okay, so let's go ahead and do that here. So right here, so negative, the negative integral of 20 x minus 12 x squared dx okay so let's integrate this remember when you integrate you raise this to the power by one and then you divide by that same power so don't forget this negative right here this is going to be 20 x squared all over 2 minus 12 x to the third all over 3 and then we're going to integrate that from sorry from 0 the three meters so zero to three meters all right um, so now when we do this uh, we can actually simplify this so our potential energy function is negative 10 x squared minus 4 x cubed so zero to three and remember do not forget that negative right there okay so again it kind of pops out so if that's negative that becomes this is negative that means, um, sorry, I should, should have written it like this. So if that's negative, this function actually writes out to negative 10x squared plus 4x cubed. So don't forget to flip your signs. All right. So now that we have that, we can now just plug in 3 in here. So let's do this. Change the potential energy with 3. It'll be negative 10 to 3 squared plus 4 times 3 cubed. And obviously, you'd have to do this again, but since this function is going to be zero, we don't have to do it again. So let's go ahead and plug that in there. So what does that give me? So that's what, uh, that's negative right here. This is negative 90. And what's that? 3 cubed is 27 times 4 plus 108. And if you do these together, change the potential energy. So that would be equal to 18 joules. Now it would be positive 18 joules. So again, if you had these flipped, okay, so if you had these flipped, you would get the negative value of this. So the correct answer for number 10 of the work energy power unit number three question is 18 joules of energy. Okay, so I hope this helped. If so, give me a thumbs up and a like for more physics content. Thank you. Have a great day.